Welcome to another Forcepoint Tech Talk Tuesday episode. In this video, we will go through how to backup and restore the Forcepoint management infrastructure. This process applies to any on-premise installation of web, email, and DLP. As always, please like, subscribe, and leave us a comment. Enjoy! The management infrastructure backup process saves the global configuration and infrastructure information, including administrator and appliance data, as well as the certificate files required for the FSM components. During the installation of the Forcepoint Security Manager, a scheduled task for backups was automatically created, but by default is disabled. To view and schedule the backup, open up Start, Administrative Tools, Task Scheduler, Task Scheduler Library. Then look for the WebSense Triton Backup. To enable the task, right-click on it and click Enable. Now the task will automatically run each week on Saturday nights at midnight. To run the backup immediately, right-click and select Run. If you would like to restore from one of these backups, then you will need to open Services and stop the service titled Forcepoint Triton Unified Security Center. Then go to Program and Features then select Forcepoint Management Infrastructure, click Uninstall slash Change. Then click Modify on the prompt. Click Next until you get to the Restored Data from Backup. Browse to the Backup folder. By default, this is in C, EIP, Backup. Click Next and Finish. Once the backup process is done, then go back and restart the Forcepoint Triton Unified Security Center. Thanks for watching this episode where we were able to go through how to backup and restore the Forcepoint Security Management infrastructure. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. And as always, please hit that like button and subscribe to show your support for this channel. See you next time.